<laughs> Got your teeth whitened too. So how did it go? Hey, pear. Yeah? I didn't feel anything. Yeah, it felt kind of good, didn't it? <sighs> I feel funny. Is this real life? Yes, this is real life. Okay, now... Okay, now I... I have two fingers. Actually, you don't have any fingers, Orange. No fingers? Ah! Oh, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. You never had fingers. I don't feel tired. You don't? Uh-uh. Did I get my teeth whitened? Uh-huh. Did, did I get my teeth whitened? Yes. No, 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 Orange, don't do that. No, 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 don't do that. Why can't I do that? Because it could mess up the teeth whitening. You have four arms. <laughs> Actually, I don't have any arms, Orange. No arms? Orange, Orange, it's okay. Orange, I never had arms in the first place. I feel funny. Why is this happening to me? <laughs> it's okay, Orange. It's just from the medicine. Is this going to be forever? No, it won't be forever. <sighs> hey, hey, Pear. Yes, Orange? Airbag. Oh! Terrifying moment for a nectarine who woke up to a knife trying to slice her in half. The woman screamed, and a friend came to her rescue, trying to fight the knife off. This incident happened early this morning in a kitchen off of Hay Apple Avenue. WBBK 11's Elizabeth Eggplant caught up with the victim. Elizabeth, emotions were running high. And Mark, the victim tells us a knife tried to cut her in half. Her friend came in and tried to help her out, but the knife got away, leaving behind, though, evidence of his visit. Nancy Nectarine was fast asleep on her counter, minding her own business when... Well, I was attacked by some idiot in the kitchen. Nancy says that someone came into the kitchen and tried to use a giant butcher knife to slice her in half. He tried to slice me. He tried to cut my peel off. Nearby, the annoying Orange heard his friend scream and tried to help, spitting seeds at the attacker until it left, but not before it was able to slice a kiwi and three limes. Well, obviously we have a knife in the kitchen. He's climbing in your windows, chopping your people up, so you better hide your kids, hide your wife, and hide your husbands because he's slicing everybody out there. The knife ended up getting away, but Orange has this message to whoever is responsible. You're an apple. You know that? You don't have to come and confess that you did it. We're looking for you. We're gonna find you. I'm letting you know that. So you can run and tell that. Knife. Now, if you have any information on this crime, you are urged to call the local police. Back to you, Mark. Wow, thanks, Elizabeth. I guess that's just one more good reason why you should lock your doors at night. Ah! He's climbing in your windows, chopping your people up, chopping, chopping. You better hide your kids, hide your wife, hide your kids, hide your wife, hide your kids, hide your wife, and hide your husbands, cause he's slicing everybody out there. You don't have to come and confess, we're looking for you, we're gonna find you, we're gonna find you. So you can run and tell that, run and tell that, run and tell that, night, 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 night. A nose? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, the rain is stopping. <gasps> Look, Orange, it's a rainbow! Yay! Whoa, it is a rainbow. Hey, hey, Charlie. Hey, Charlie, hey. Charlie, see the rainbow. Hey, Charlie, hey, Charlie, wake up. Charlie, we it's a rainbow. a rainbow. God, you guys, this better be pretty freaking important. Is the kitchen on fire again? We have to go see the rainbow. Yeah, Charlie. we have to go get the pot of gold. Come on, the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. Let's go. Pot of gold. Sure. I'm going back to sleep now. No. Please stop jumping on me. Yeah, I want my pot of gold, Charlie. Let's go. Hurry. I love rainbows and puppies and kittens and flowers and rainbows and clouds and bunnies and rainbows. All right, fine. I'll go with you to see the rainbow. No, you're doing it wrong, Marshmallow. It's like this. God, would you guys knock it off already? Jeez, why don't you stop horning in? <laughs> Hey, hey, Charlie. What? Hey, Charlie, hey. What? What are you going to buy with your share of the gold? I'm going to buy a pot of gold. You guys do realize that there actually isn't a pot of gold at the end of the rainbow, right? I'm going to buy more rainbows. <laughs> you can't buy a friggin' rainbow. Then I'll buy a rainbow machine that'll make millions of rainbows. Yay! Oh, God, wait. Who is that? It's Parent Midget Apple. 
Come on, guys. We're going to go get the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. Yay! Yay! Charlie's giving us a ride. Hop on. Yay for Charlie! Oh, no. I am not carrying all you guys and those suitcases. But they're important, Charlie. Yeah, they're important, Charlie. Oh, come on, Charlie. Charlie! 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 Charl
waking up in the kitchen Gotta get fresh, gotta get online Gotta go upload my new video See everyone, I gotta get going, yeah I'm an orange but I'm rushing Gotta get down to the food stop Gotta tell some puns to my friends Paris in the front seat Passion's in the back seat Gotta make my mind up Which seat can I take? It's Friday, Friday Going to TGI Fridays Everybody's looking for a napkin, napkin Friday, Friday Catching up on Friday Everybody's looking for another napkin Partying, partying, yeah! partying, partying yeah! Hey, why aren't the brakes working anymore? 745 are flying through the sky Cruising so fast this eagle can fly Fun, fun, think about fun You know what it is I got lips, you got lips <laughs> I got lips, you got lips. <laughs> Hair is on the pony's head, passion's on the rear end. Gotta make my mind up, which seat can I take? Uh, hey, oh, annoying orange. Woo-hoo. Here I am from the front side, from the back side. Nah, I'm on the driver's yeah, side. Yeah. Playing brains, switching lanes. Is that grandpa lemon on a ride? Woo-hoo. Running over carrots, that kid in my way. Gotta get fries, what can I say? Check my time, it's Friday, it's a weekend. We gonna strike gold. Friday, Friday, gotta catch up on Friday. Everybody's looking for a napkin, napkin. Friday, Friday, catching up on Friday. Everybody's looking for another napkin. Party and party and yeah! party and party and yeah! everybody's looking for another napkin. <laughs> Hello, my fruits! It's FPS Orange, and I have something very nice for you today. Say hello to the 50 caliber kitchen cannon. It doesn't slice, it doesn't dice, it just goes boom! <laughs> and that's why you're gonna fire it outside, right? Don't jump the gun, Pear! We'll be outside in no time! <laughs> no! Ah, nothing like a little fresh air! <laughs> Now, the kitchen cannon isn't just a big gun. It's a big gun that goes boom, boom, boom. And we like that. Plus, it shoots all kinds of rounds. Check it out. Right now, we've got this baby loaded with explosive cherry bombs. I know, I know. I hate clip shows, too. (laughs) Seriously, though, cherry bombs are great for when the pit really hits the fan. (laughs) Hey, hey, apples. What? about the kitchen cannon is that it can fire all kinds of rounds. Right now, I've got it loaded with full-on semi-automatic Nerf rounds. I call it the Porky Pair. The Porky what? <laughs> Thanks for sticking around, Pear. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. We're not finished yet. In fact, we saved the best for last. I call this one the Hey Diddle Diddle. Okay, I'll bite. Why do you call it that? Cause this cow's about to jump over the moon. <laughs> or maybe just throw it. Remember, don't try this unless you're a professional. Orange. <laughs> well, that's it. We're out of here. <laughs> hey, who cut the cheese? Oh wait, it was me. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video, and as always, have a nice day! <laughs> Watch out! Incoming! <laughs> Dessert, I, I, I just, I couldn't stop thinking about it. Yeah? So, I went to the freezer, where all the frozen goodies are, and you, you yeah. know what was in there? What was in there? You know that ice cream with the sprinkles that you really like? Yeah, the ice cream with the sprinkles! Yeah, yeah, I, I, I took that out, and I put even more sprinkles more on it. Spr- yeah, and then I put some chocolate and strawberries and fudge on it too. Yeah. And I said to myself, you know who would really love to have this? Yeah. Me. So I ate it. Aww. But I love fudgy chocolate strawberry sprinkle ice cream. I know. And you know what? I was just finishing up the ice cream when I looked outside. It, it had just stopped oh. raining. Yeah? Yeah. And all of a sudden, this rainbow appeared. <gasps> a rainbow? Uh-huh. 
It was so big and colorful, it just it lit up the entire sky. Yeah? Yeah, and you know what happened? What? It disappeared before I could tell you about it. Uh, uh, you gotta be kidding me! Nope, not kidding ya. And you know what happened after that? What? The doorbell rang. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, so, so I answered it. Yeah? And guess what it was? What? It was a whole group of cuddly animals. <gasps> Yeah, yeah, there were bunnies, bunnies. and puppies. And puppies? Yeah, and kittens. And kittens? I know. And you know what I did? What? You were taking a nap, so I cuddled with them all myself. Ah! Question, what's something you've always wanted to do? Burp so loud it knocks down a chandelier. Okay, but seriously, what's something realistic you've always wanted to do? I I've always wanted to eat an entire boat. I want to get squished by a celebrity. Being serious! It was a serious question. Wait, who's that? Shia LaBeouf? What's he doing in the kitchen? No clue. Uh, maybe we should ask him what he's doing here? Do it! Do what? Just do it! Hard to argue with that, I guess. What does he want me to do? Why is he yelling? Just tell me what to do and I'll do it! I swear! <laughs> Don't let your dreams be dreams. You know what? Shia's right! I've never actually tried to burp so loud it brought down a chandelier. Maybe I'll just work on it tomorrow. Yesterday, you said tomorrow. So just do it! Okay! <coughs> Yay! Am I doing it? Make your dreams come true! What the what? <coughs> just do it! Wow! I can't believe it! It is possible! It really isn't, guys. Shut up, Pear! You're a naysayer! Well, I'm following my dreams! Yeah! I want a poop rainbow! <laughs> uh. Some people dream of success while you're gonna wake up and work hard at it! Yeah! Shy is right! <laughs> Nothing is impossible! False! Quiet, you naysayer! <laughs> you should get to the point where anyone else would quit, and you're not gonna stop there! No, what are you waiting for? Uh, Here goes nothing. Please, squish me! Just, yeah! Do it! <laughs> what an inspiration! I'm gonna do it too! Yeah! What? Yeah! Just, do it! You can't be serious! Yes, you can! Just do it! <gasps> Yay! You did it, Orange! And I did it too! Me too! Me too. Mm -hmm. Yay! You are all crazy! What do you think? You ready? Of course I'm not ready! I pedal myself pretty much any time a dentist gets a drill anywhere near my mouth. All right, any final words, Midget Apple? Ugh, don't call me that. It's Brittle Apple. No, 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 you're doing it wrong. It's more of a. No, 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 Nah, D minus. Friday, Friday, gotta get down on Friday. This is a message from the kitchen emergency podcasting system. Zombies are loose in the kitchen. I repeat, they are loose in the kitchen, and they're like, they're like totally after you delicious, delicious boy. Whoa, zombies? Well, that bites. Alert? Yeah, and it is not a test. Hurry, get over here, bro. Ah! 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 You wait here. I'll get the supplies. Is this real life? Okay, I got the stuff. Rubber chicken, kazoo, whoopee cushion, another kazoo. Why are you putting rubber chickens in 
TNT. <laughs> no, you're gonna need to defend yourself. I can't be with you the whole time, okay? <laughs> Look, this is how you use it. The safety's right here. Inside its butt? Yep, right in there. Go ahead, reach right in. <laughs> Little Apple, we can only take one friend. Which friend? Marshmallow or Grandpa Lemon? Marshmallow, you idiot! Why don't you take Grandpa Lemon? He smells like dusty barf! He won't last two seconds out there against the zombies! Leave him! Get Marshmallow! <laughs> Yay! Thanks for choosing me! It means the world! Shut up, Marshmallow! It was a pragmatic decision! Nothing personal! <laughs> I understood like zero words in that sentence! Okay, little apple, we're gonna rally with the other fruits in Munchkin Land. How well do you speak Munchkinese? Why? Why? Cause I'm small. You automatically assume. We don't have time for this, little apple. I do not speak Munchkinese, you jerks. Do you think we should stop by the fridge for some more supplies? No. It's gonna be a bloodbath in there. Yeah. Yeah. He's probably right. He's probably right. Let's go anyway. <laughs> Sure is dark in here. Well, yeah. This is what it's like inside the fridge when the door's shut. I'm going out for supplies. I'll be right back. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, oh, no. The zombies got him. <laughs> ah, they got Marshmallow too. Get us out of here. The fridge is growing with zombies. Oh, hello there. Ah. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> what? What's going on? We pranked you, bro. There's no zombie apocalypse. You... Uh, what? <laughs> Personally, I didn't expect you to fall for it so hard. Yeah, I thought you'd only fall for it a little. <laughs> <laughs> I literally piddled myself, God! <laughs> oh, 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 yeah. Whatever! Good luck getting it out of the leather seats, you meanies! <laughs> <laughs> Ew. case of cotton mouth. <laughs> Are you done now? Yeah. Just gonna grab something to drink. Oh, maybe some ice water. Great. See you later. Oh! <laughs> Why would you do that? Well, duh. Everybody's doing it. To themselves. Everyone's doing it to themselves. I'm confused. Why would anybody prank themselves? <laughs> it's not a prank, Orange. They're doing it to help fight ALS. Hey, you stay away from Alice. She didn't do nothing to you. You tell him, Orange. Not Alice, A-L-S. It's a disease. People are pouring buckets of ice water on themselves to raise awareness and donate money to find a cure. Oh, well in that case, let the healing begin. Ha! Yo, dude, what's going on? Ah! Oh, you jerks! I was just about to do the ice bucket challenge on my channel. Dude, stop being so selfish. Orange, you're doing this all wrong. Well, if helping a noble cause is wrong, then I don't want to be right. Yay! Oh, that's cool, baby. <laughs> Best charity ever. <laughs> oh, what? Whoa, what? Yeah! No! Oh, look at the water ripple on my muscles. <laughs> it's freezing. One, just one, and then you are done. <laughs> <laughs> oh, suddenly I feel like I've learned the folly of my ways. Oh, can I do a do-over? No. Nah. So what happens now? Well, if you had done it right, you could nominate someone else for the challenge. But in this case, I think you'd better just cough up a donation. Good call. <laughs> Dude, gross. What? Don't they take Visa? <laughs> yeah! Uh...
Is it just me or is it a bit warm in here? I think you're right. It is a little warm. Oh no! Twin Pop melted into a puddle in two sticks. I just don't understand what it could be. The thermostat's turned way down. trouble you guys this knife is like a thousand degrees and he's chopping everything in sight i'm not worried i have my renfair chain meal to protect me and i've got my cat-like reflexes to keep me safe ooh, ah, ooh, ah, <laughs> and i have the power of love Yay! marshmallow don't do it hello there mr thousand degree knife i'm marshmallow would you like to be my friend uh... Marshmallow, are you okay? Sure am! And best of all, I got this cool new androgynous haircut! Yippee! Okay. Orange, look out! Ah! Oh man, this thousand degree knife can cut through anything! Well, it can't cut through the Sword of Kitchenshire! The Sword of Kitchenshire was forged in the depths of. Oh, guys, it definitely can cut through the Sword of Kitchenshire! Ah! Our only hope is to pull that knife down somehow! Did somebody say cool? No! I'm serious! We need to literally make that knife colder or we're all doomed! If only there was somewhere in the kitchen that was extremely cold! You mean like the freezer? Exactly! Thanks, Marshy! That was a really great idea! Turns out this isn't hair on my head! My brain just grew a bunch! <laughs> Orange, lure the thousand degree knife into the freezer and chill him out! You got it! Hey! Oh, he's good. Very cat-like. Hey, knife! Hey! Hey, thousand-degree knife! Hey! What? Maybe you should have stayed home today. It looks like you have a temperature. <laughs> That's it. Cat-like reflexes! Cat-like reflexes! Cat-like reflexes! Meow! <laughs> Let me out! It's... It's so cold in here. No way, dude. You stay in there until you chill out. <laughs> Orange, you did it. I sure did. And it's all thanks to Marshmallow's quick thinking and my cat-like reflexes. <laughs> <laughs>